Hi, everybody, and welcome into today's IPTA ClemsonTigers.com football report. It is a Thursday with Tim as we spend this segment here with Clemson Sports Information Director Tim Beret getting ready for North Carolina to come rolling in to Death Valley this Saturday. And again, another team where there's a lot of history. There is a lot of history. It goes all the way back to 1897. Just the sixth game in Clemson history was against North Carolina. Actually, the first game against a team currently uh, in the ACC. But there's some, been some great games over the years. 1958, Coach Howard had a big win uh, against North Carolina. I think it was his 100th career uh, victory. And, of course, who can forget the 1981 game? We're going to honor the 1981 team this weekend. 10-8 uh, defensive struggle. Uh, that uh, Clemson won at the end when Jeff Bryant recovered a fumble that everybody else thought was a pass. Uh, but uh, that was a, a, a one of the most memorable games since I've been at Clemson. Well, let's talk a little bit about that 81 game, and especially since they're going to be honoring the 81 team uh, here this weekend. You go back, it's a road game. Uh, you know, it's one of those top 10 matchups, which is kind of rare in the Atlantic Coast Conference in that time. And it really was one of those not only big for Clemson, but also for the league. Yeah, it was. It was the first meeting of top 10 teams in the history of uh, ACC. Clemson was second and undefeated going into that game. North Carolina was ranked eighth, had just one loss at that point in time. Uh, the big story going into the game was the health of Kelvin Bryant, who that year had scored 15 touchdowns in the first three games of the year, then had a knee injury and had this uh, really weird type of surgery nobody had ever heard of arthroscopic surgery <laughs> and it was amazing that he could possibly come back and play against Clemson but he did uh, had a good game but uh, Clemson kept North Carolina out of the end zone that day with a great defense the fridge had a great game as a uh, freshman and Jeff McCall scored the only touchdown of the game for Clemson and you go back and you look at some other games on the road up there I remember uh, the game with Rod Gardner when uh, went up there and caught a couple of touchdown passes and a big win for the Tigers yeah I actually caught uh, three that was in the 2000 season the last time Clemson started out with a run like we're on uh, right now uh, Woody Dantzler was injured Willie Simmons came off the bench through four touchdown passes three of them to Rod Gardner Tigers were down 17 points in that game uh, and then came back to win, almost uh, similar to what we uh, just saw last week against Maryland, being down 18 points and coming back to win. All right, and because of the unbalanced schedule, we don't get to see the Tar Heels as regularly as uh, as maybe some fans would want. So let's talk about uh, success against them here in this building. At 17 and 7, Clemson uh, has a 17 and 7 record against North Carolina uh, here, and done quite well uh, over the uh, over the years. And um, especially the last time they were here. Clemson dominated North Carolina in the 2006 season, but North Carolina's had some big moments in here. I remember the 1980 game when a guy named Lawrence Taylor uh, with a North Carolina team that won the ACC championship that year. Uh, Clemson came back with a guy named Wilbur Bullard who had 47 career rushing yards, had 44 in the fourth quarter of that game. Uh, Clemson almost won, but lost 24 to 19. All right, Bullard family, wherever you are, there, there you go. There's, there's your mention uh, for uh, the day. And I can remember when one Julius Peppers came in That's here right. and just put on an absolute show also Correct. against uh, the Tigers. All right, so there's a little bit on uh, the Clemson North Carolina series. Of course, it is a 12 noon kickoff here in Death Valley. Show up in your orange, be loud and proud. Should be a lot of fun in Death Valley this Saturday. For Tim Beret, I'm Don Munson. Thanks for being with us here on ClemsonTigers.com.